Hello guys, in this tutorial we're going to talk about how to add uh, text and logo watermark in a video using OpenShot uh, video editor. So just go ahead and open the uh, OpenShot video editor and uh, we're going to add uh, the logo and the video in this uh, particular video editor. So in order to add video just need to click on this uh, under menu bar just click on this plus uh, green icon like so and just navigate to where you have your video and just select the video then uh, you can add them together just click the video and then you hold down the control key then click uh, the logo then that will be added the two of them so what you need to do you're going to add just click uh, the video i'm just going to start with the video and drag down to uh, the track so these are the tracks we have around i think five tracks so let me expand the preview the video preview so i have my video and uh, just uh, let me just play it again and see uh, it does not have audio so uh, let's say you this is your video now uh, you want to add text uh, so in order to add a text watermark uh, you need to on the first uh, first area uh, around four uh, tabs that's file editor title view help you need to click on this title and uh, under title just click title again now you have uh, several templates that you can choose from uh, so we're going to choose a template and then we're going to edit those particular that particular template uh, i normally like my text watermark on the top right hand side on the left top and right hand side and uh, this will be head header one just choose header one and then it will give you these options of uh, uh, editing your title. So the the file name I'm just going to name it watermark. Then line one is the text that you want the text that you want displayed on your video. So, and then you can just choose to change the font. Uh, I like using uh, Times New Roman. So I'll just type in T and uh, all the fonts under T, starting with T, uh, will be displayed. And uh, if I scroll down, I'm now able to see the T and I want it uh, bold. And uh, the font size, you can choose the font, font size that is uh, suitable for your video. And I'll go for 36 and click OK. And so the text, uh, so the text color, the custom color, just choose white. For me, white is OK. I choose the background, but uh, I think. Uh, that's okay for me just click save now you have your text or your watermark what you need to do again you need to add this particular watermark above your 
video you need to add it on the of the the track that's above your video so just drag it and add it and as you can see uh it's quite shorter than the video so what you need to do is to if we just click on in the watermark you can see under properties time is actually one and uh, if you click so it, and we have, uh, if you click on uh, this watermark uh, you'll see the end time is uh, I think 10 seconds and if you click on our video it's 20 uh, I think 20 seconds something yeah so what you need to do is to just make it uh, equal to the video just drag drag it across until it's now equal to that particular or you can just let me do so that you can try to edit that make it to 20.44 and click enter yes so it's now equal to a video and uh, if you play a video there you have your text watermark you need to change a few things i think the alpha this one is quite so i think the alpha is too much uh, just make sure that you click on this particular watermark that the on your left hand side is under properties you need to change the values and uh, just make it 0 0.5 and click enter so i think by 0 0.5 is quite too much make it 0 0.3 so we can just and also make it 0 0.2 so and i think that is okay so if you play now have your video and uh, text editor so you can just uh, export and i'm going to export just give it a name file name uh, and just give it text watermark that then choose where you want to save your project and uh, just select the folder like that then use hd if you want to uh, maximum quality hd 1080p 30 uh, frames per second choose that then export now uh, the export of the video uh, with text watermark is done so yes we're going to now remove just click on the watermark then right click then click remove clip now we are going to add the logo so just click on the logo and drag on top on the top of the on the top track so click on the video check on the properties and uh, check the end time so 
previously you would see that it's uh, ends at uh, 20 seconds in 4 4 and if we check our and if we click on the logo uh, it's only ends at 10 seconds so we can double click on that to edit and then just type in 20.44 like that then as you can see uh, the logo is quite large and we don't want that and then want to edit and so that it can fit on a so just click on the logo the track and then it will give you the properties on the left hand side and then what you need to do is to go for look for uh scale you have this scale so we're going to scale the x and the y so just double click on uh scale x and uh, give it like zero point so by default it's actually one one is equivalent to hundred percent so we have to do give it 0 0.2 that's like 20 percent click enter and then under scale y double click on it and give it also 0 0.2 so you can see that's quite uh, reasonable uh, now you can see it's uh, the center you don't want that you want it at the uh, top left corner so what you need to do you can that there are two ways you can uh, go around this first method you can use is to go to location x just still under properties and uh, make sure that uh, the logo is selected so under location x just double click and give it like let's say negative 0 0.44 click enter the log will move to the left hand side with this negative and uh, if you do 0 0.44 just 0 0.4 positive 0 0.44 will take you to the right hand side so what you want is uh, negative want it on the left hand side and if you give it negative 0 0.44 also the location y uh, the log will be moved to the top right corner but uh, again if you do 0 0.44 positive it will move to bottom right corner so let's let's make it one so that we can use the gravity you have this gravity uh, button what to do is to click on it and try to drag uh, Okay, just let me just delete that and add again. So this time around we're going to use the gravity. So what you do is to make sure that you are under this gravity and just click it and drag towards the right hand side. Now it's on the left. It's now on the right, but now oh we have forgotten make sure that you scale to 0 0.2 both the x and y 0 0.2 now go back to gravity and uh, left click and hold then drag to the left again the right the bottom left corner you want it at the top
top left corner if you do you go to the left drag the left to take you to top right corner left again top center top right uh, let's leave it at uh, top right so if you try now to play the video so let me pause again and restart the video so we want to as the video plays you want to uh, the, this particular location of the logo you want to reduce the opacity so in order to reduce the opacity uh, you need to edit the alpha and uh, just click uh, the logo and uh, the left hand side uh, the property number one is alpha and that's what we're going to edit just double click on it and uh, make it something like uh, 0 0.3 and click enter so see play you can see it's not that bad so you can just play around with the values in this particular uh, alpha and uh, choose the value that suits your video so again just as usual uh, going to export and so this time around we're just going to uh, save it under desktop select youtube and export So that's what uh, process is complete. Uh, you can just go ahead and uh, close down the problem. So I have project. Let me move in the folder. Now this is uh, our original video. As you can see. So this is the original video, there's no watermark, there's no text watermark, there's no logo watermark. So uh, let me open the ones that we've just created. We start with the text watermark and so as you can see in the uh, top left corner, we have the watermark right there. So that's how you uh, add the text watermark using the open uh, short video editor. So let me again open the one with the logo. So as you can see on the top left corner, you have your logo. So basically that's how you add the logo and uh, text watermark in your video using the open shot video edit so that's it for this tutorial guys uh, thank you for watching kindly remember to subscribe give this video a uh, thumbs up and uh, see you in the next tutorial